What's up, y'all? It's your girl, Kimmy, back with another Dollar Tree haul. You guys, this is my second time trying to film, film this haul. Excuse my hair. Just got out the shower, and it is, like, all over the place. Forgive me. But I just wanted to come on here and do this quick haul with y'all. I am so excited about the items that I did find. Um, over this past weekend, I went to three different Dollar Trees, you guys. And to my shocking, the last Dollar Tree that I went to, which is, like, the hood Dollar Tree, they had some stuff. And I couldn't really shop because I had the kids with me, but... It is what it is. I, I was able to grab like a few things. So we're just going to jump right into this. Okay. So for one, I'm going to, I oh, because this is my second time trying to film, I opened some stuff. Because my lighting, y'all, I hate my lighting in my room. It's just so dark and icky. And so I just can't wait to get the studio done because I want to be able to film in some like popping light. Y'all, this is my natural curly hair. So, yeah, I'm going to tell you. All right, so the first product that I did pick up was from the baking company and it is actually um through acne you guys it's nine piece cupcake decorator set so this is what it looks like i took it out already um basically you screw these tips off and it has eight of these different decor nozzles on it and you just screw it back on um, luckily, at my Dollar Tree, it was the only one left, and I grabbed it before anybody else could grab it. Of course, I'm assuming that it was only one left because everybody couldn't believe that that was at the Dollar Tree. Was this Color Mate lip oil, and it looks like this. And this is a Dollar Tree product, you guys, I think, I think, I think. No, I actually don't see the Dollar Tree manufacturer stamp on here. So it's not, but it does and, um, come with the Valentine's Day decor things and we're going to put this on so you guys can see it works pretty nice now i did do it put it on in the first tape and my lips are kind of dry so that's probably why it's a dollar in the dollar tree where i'm so excited about this y'all um i've come to the conclusion that i'm in love with the farmhouse theme type stuff and i'm going to do my kitchen in that theme y'all my hair really looks crazy <laughs> it's cool it's cool it's gonna get done this week but I'm like super obsessed with like the farmhouse theme. So I picked up two of these signs. And this is what they look like. Alright. So this one has the checkerboard background with the white frame. And inside the middle it says, This kitchen is seasoned with love. The print is really pretty. I feel like it's something that you would see at Home Goods on one of their products. Or maybe Big Lots. Big Lots has a nice amount of um, home decor that has like really pretty print on it. And it's really pretty you guys. Kind of thick as you can see the backing is hollow so you are able to hang it without any problem and this one has that wood green with the gray frame and this one just says um welcome to our home now dollar tree has been using this home print on almost everything i'm kind of sick of it but i really really like the frame so i got it i feel like they are up here um, if you do know if there are more of these please comment down below because i would love to get all of them to sport in my kitchen Oh, and these also can be used for DIYs, you guys. You can turn these into trays if you wanted to. Christmas is gone and done. And now their Christmas decor is on sale, so 50% off. So I just went over there to look. And in my home decor tour haul, I told you guys that I was in love with those magnets that I had in my refrigerator. Really small, but they did like they made my refrigerator look really, really pretty and festive. So I found these. These two packs, which I paid 50 cent a piece for, and they are magnets like the ones that are on my refrigerator. They are not the same theme, but they are cute. They have the three snowmen with some trees, some birds, snowflakes, some um, poinsettias. Um, I'm not really a fan of the like cartoon like stuff, but this is kind of stuff I pick up for the kids so that they can enjoy the festivities of Christmas and putting stuff up. So, this is something that they like to do. So, I got two packs of these. Sorry if I'm looking back there, I can see myself back there and it's like disturbing me, but I will try to like focus. Was this coffee signed? And it says, Coffee because adulting is hard. The coffee is in a gold. Um, I'm probably going to have to open this and refurbish the coffee part because it looks like it's peeling or coming up. All of them look like that. This was the only one that I seen that was not like had um, that didn't have the coffee sign really messed up. Um, but if you guys know that I showed y'all my other haul, if you were to peel this gold lettering up, there is like a wood lettering under it and it looks really pretty because it looks like raw wood. So you can do that too. I also thought about making this into a tray by putting handles on the side. Um, yeah, so the background is like that kind of wood, that soft white wood, and I really liked it. It has the clip on the back. 
sorry if I don't have as much spunk I was like really hyped in my first clip and I'm like super irritated now so it's not as much spunk there all right so one of Dollar Tree's new items if you guys don't know Dollar Tree does have a website you are able to buy some things um, and in the quantities of four, but most of their stuff you have to buy in bulk. But you can go on their website and see like all of the new things that have came out in 20, 2020 to 2021 because we're just recently entering 2021. And they're supposed to be having new items dropping very soon, so keep your eyes peeled for that. But I did pick up these 3D wreath forms, and they say on there that they are in the shape of a sphere, so they open up 3D. And basically, like you can see in that flower ball, you can make big flower ball form, forms. I am planning on doing a DIY with these. Um, one is a 10 inch and one is a 14 inch. You can see the size difference. So they do have both um, diameters available at Dollar Tree. Next, I picked up, I don't have any use for this, but I just could not stop eyeing it. It's so pretty. So I picked up this holographic type folder. And it has like some pretty clouds on it with some blue, purple, and black with the star connections on it as well. It has this little lift here where you open it. The backing is clear. It's not a full, well, it's a two-sided folder. I think that's what it's called where it's connected on two sides. You only have that one flip. The only negative about it is you're not able to put it in a binder. You, now, if you do have one of those binder punchers, of course, you can punch your holes out and be able to put it in your binder. But... I got it because I have hella paper. I always have a lot of paperwork because I have a lot of kids and I can always use the organization. Okay. Next two items. So you guys know from the last Dollar Tree haul, three items as a matter of fact, I was trying to find recipe books. Um, very seldomly do I spend like a lot of money on books because I love Goodwill and I love Dollar Tree. They both have a lot of books available to you for cheap prices. I know Goodwill books um, range from one to three dollars and Dollar Tree of course is a dollar so I was looking for some recipe books because I want to try some new recipes with me and the kids and my family so I got this magazine um, I'm not a magazine reader so I don't know if this is like a good brand but it's called relish and this magazine has 79 recipes for family that's what caught my eye actually the macaroni and cheese on the front is what caught my eye you know what I'm saying because I'm a fan of Mac and nothing too, too, um, you know, great. This is actually what caught my eye. This barbecue beef tater type casserole. I've never had casserole if I can remember. And I want to see if I like it. They also have a taco one too. And these books are called Food We Love. I got two of them. But they were, they did have several books like this with different food themes on it. So we have this five star brunch tasty appetizing recipes and this one has more of the brunch meals in it as you can see um i also like recipe books with pictures so these have pictures in them not on every page but it does have pictures and this one just has you know brunch food like sandwiches and granola and stuff like that french french toast like a different spin on french toast so yeah i got that one and this one is just for sweets as you can see on the back it has like some hot cocoa cinnamon rolls um truffle um i was like oh yeah rice pudding not too let, uh, comment down below if you like rice pudding but cookie ice cream sandwiches from scratch just a lot of stuff i'm not a fan of coconut either but peanut butter kiss cookies thing i picked up i feel like there are more of these they are i think i've seen more but these are the only two that i like so we have these two signs one is in this um light blue color and the other one is gold this first one has a rainbow on it and it says chasing it has that purple sequence in it and then this one is gold with the mermaid tail and it has stay magic i think yeah with the gold sequence so what i plan on doing with these is you guys know that my daughter Aaliyah and her brother share a room and i just feel like she doesn't have her own space to be girly and stuff like that so i kind of want to give her her wall and these are just like really cute and they're easy to hang they have this ribbon on them you could just hang it up on the wall next thing i picked up were two different um candle holders these are well this is square and a circle of course they both have that gold lining at the top um, very well done. It's very neat. It's not sloppy. That's the kind of stuff that I look at when I pick up stuff. They have the um, things on the bottom, the grips that stop them from moving. You can use these for coasters. You can use these for candle holders. Um, I'm not really sure what I'm going to use them for yet. I just thought they were really pretty. And then I also picked up, for those who don't, who didn't watch my other Dollar Tree haul, I said that I was going to be doing a Valentine's Day surprise bag for all of my kids. And so, um, my oldest daughter is really big on, she's really big on do-rags. She loves do-rags. So I found these two. Um, this one is my favorite. 
because it has like those deep blues and reds like the colors are really deep and it's just really you can actually see like the tie-dye swirl which i feel like i'm gonna wrap her basket up with these and then i got her this one with the more lighter um well it's the same colors but the tones are a little bit more softer and it has flowers on it this um lunch storage tower so my res one of my resolutions is to try to eat healthier i feel like this is really easy a lot of the times when I am ripping and running. My problem is I don't eat. And then when I do eat, because I'm out, I end up eating fast food. So I thought this would be like perfect. So the, the good thing about this is it's two, compart it's two compartments. And I was looking at the picture and I was like, you know, that would have been cool if it came with a little dish. But it does, okay? So it opens up on both ends. This part is in the middle. Like that. And then this part is just a container. And this part has that little dish in it. So you could put like your peanut butter, your ranch, your blue cheese in it. And I actually want to get a couple more of these for the kids. Because I feel like these would be cool to just throw in their book bags when they go back to school. Or when we're in a car. You guys know I have a new car and it's hard for me to give them snacks and stuff. Because I'm scared they're going to like mess the car up. Alright and then y'all I was super sold. Super hyped. I've never seen these in Dollar Tree. Comment down below if you have. But they had the Vicks Cough Drops menthol and cherry and then you have 20 in a pack of each but these are from the brand Vicks as you can see so anytime I see like name brand stuff depending on the quantity I go ahead and grab it because it's at Dollar Tree like why not <laughs> all right and then Dollar Tree has brought in brought in their um pet supplies uh area it's actually getting bigger it's kind of expensive to take care of your to take care of a pet so Dollar Tree does offer um I haven't seen anything outside of pet and I mean cat and dog but they have cat and dog supplies so I picked up these soft shoes soft treats ocean medley flavor for the cats and it's the brand nine lives and you get it doesn't say how much you get in here but it does say that it is a 2.1 ounce pack next this is from the brand Pez if you don't know what Pez is like it's an old school shoe okay and this is actually a Pez brand and just from this the sticker in the back if I want to it gives me like Rite Aid or CVS dot, um, vibes like I've seen this on their stuff before but it says one size fits most and it's two pairs in a pack and these are called toe cappers so basically when you wear high heels it takes the pressure off of your feet um lately I have been trying to get back into my heels you guys I love heels and I stopped wearing them for a minute but I noticed that on New Year's when I wore my boots like the front of my feet were killing me so I went and grabbed them I don't know how it works because it, it, does, it doesn't come all the way up your feet as you can see on there so I don't know how it stays but it does have the grips in the back these little grippers you can't really see them yes you can little plastic grippers rubber grippers grippers and it has padding this padding is like really soft actually I don't know how you could that see how thick that is and then next, I grabbed this coupon holder. It is from the brand Jot. As you guys know, Dollar Tree has a brand called Jot for all their stationaries. And um, this has six pockets in it. This is really cool. So it's in the color pink, as you can see. It's like a highlighter pink. And it has this tab. You pull it up, and it comes out like this. And then each um, part has six, I think, like three folders in it. But it flips out. And it has, like, these little slots. So basically you can put like my plan is to mark each one with like bills or anything I have to that needs to be paid for the month and because I have like some um laminate I'm sure you guys but I plan on you know labeling these as far as bills and then putting the money in them to make it easy easier on me as far as bill paying bills and stuff like that but you could put anything you want in here you could put receipts rent receipts money um money orders um anything like your kids trip slips then next i got these rembrandt whitening strips now i have seen um whitening tools in dollar tree before it's the specific one that i've seen on tiktok that i'm looking for haven't found it yet but these are basically the strips um you get four strips that cover two treatments and they go on your teeth you leave them for on, on for 30 minutes and then you take them off um i am going to be trying these because i'm curious um, comment down below if you guys want me to do a Dollar Tree try where I just try random stuff, even food, and, you know, give my take on it. But, yeah. Um, Rembrandt, I think, is a dental, um, brand. I'm not really sure. I think I've seen that before, Rembrandt. They had this, like, these funky, um, this. They just had this. It was, like, a stand with a bunch of them on it and it had, like, cars for this, for whoever this is. 
It had these, and I think it had like surprise boxes. But I, once I read them, I, knew, I didn't know what they were at first. But Blizzard is, I feel like, is an energy drink, and I think that's who this is sponsored by, or or who this is who it came from. Yeah, Blizzard Entertainment is at the bottom. But basically, they're just different iron-on patches. You get two patches in here, two embroidery patches, and you can iron them on. My kids really like weird stuff like this that looks like this. So this is something that I'll probably put in their Valentine's Day surprise bag. Um, I'm not, it doesn't tell you what is in here, like which one is in here, but it does say that it has two patches. So I thought that was cute. So I grabbed two of these. Take two. Action. Alright, y'all. Girlfriends. So I don't do, I, I like the idea of makeup, but I don't do makeup. One, because I don't have the patience. Um, I feel like everybody I've talked to have told me that they take hours on their makeup. And two, because I'm not a professional. You know what I mean? I have done my makeup before and I did like it. But Dollar Tree's makeup section is pretty bomb if you go check it out. Like, I don't know, you know, their products and what does what. I know people are very funny about the products they use on their face. But um, you might can find a YouTube video as to what products are, like, worth it and what isn't. But they have Maybelline, you guys. And if you don't know, Maybelline is a big um, makeup brand. And this is called Lip Paint. And it's in the color Never Bare. I, for one, love color on the lip. I don't have a problem with color on the lip. I know some people will not dare. But it does not look right on me like darker colors, like purple and black. But the pinks always get me, okay? So I just figure I do have my, like my little makeup collection and stuff that I use when I want to get dressed up. So that's just what this is for. I'm just going to throw this in here. If I don't end up using it, I'll probably give it to my daughter's. My last haul, I showed you guys the lashes that Sanaya got. And honestly, you guys, she did them by herself. And they were so pretty on her. So I got her another pair. Um, this is cute. This is cute to throw in a gift bag or something like that. Especially if your child is into makeup. Because they're, um, the, first of all, the lash glue that they pair with this is not harsh on the um, eyelash. And secondly, they're easy to apply. And they're re she can reuse them or throw them out. I wouldn't advise reusing them so many times like people would do regular eyelashes. Because I feel like they're plas like plastic plastic. But they were really cute on her. And she did it really well. So um, I got her another pair. This is from the... I feel like this is only there for Valentine's Day. So if you guys are interested, you should probably go down to your Dollar Tree and get them. Because they have this Valentine's Day logo at the top with the reds and the pinks and all that good stuff and the roses. So if you are interested in getting some just for, you know, your child. Or if you just want to spend a dollar on lashes, we go down to your Dollar Tree. All right, and then I also found this Wet n Wild Complexion Concealer, okay? And it is in a happy medium. Um, I wasn't going to use this. I actually felt like I was either going to give it to my daughter or give it away to somebody who likes makeup. But it helps with dark areas. You guys know what concealer is. If you don't, you can, like, Google it and it'll tell you. Basically, you put it on your dark areas of your face when you're applying makeup. This one is cool because when you snap it up, the makeup goes to the top and you can paint it on like a brush. And then next, during these days, you guys, you know that people are really big on sanitization and keeping down the germs and stuff like that. So Dollar Tree now has these portable drinking straws. And I got two. I got one for me and I got one for my mom. I'm going to open it for you. It says eco-friendly, easy to clean, portable travel case, and reusable. So it has the little tag where you can put it on like your bag. And when you open it, it comes with the cleaner thingy. And it comes with a rubber reusable straw. And I thought that was just so cute because, you know, you go out and you're in your car and you hot and you buy a drink. And, you you know, you wipe your top off. But just to be safe. like. And you guys know that um, from the last haul, I was going to be doing my binder planner, which I'm so proud of. I love it. I'm going to show you guys at the end of this haul. But now I just want to like, you know, bring some new colors and stuff into my pencils and my pens. I'm really big on pens and stuff. So I found these felt tip pens and they are from Crayola, you guys. Haven't used them yet. I'm not sure what felt tip means. I know what felt feels like, but I'm not sure what, what it means. But it's washable. Washable. And it gets smooth lines, it says. So I got the color Surf's Up and See the Change. You get two for the price of one. And I feel like, I'm going to see. Because I feel like when I go to Walmart, like this is going to be like $3. And moving on. Alright, next item is a phone stand, you guys. So I'm not a big fan of Dollar Tree's electronic section as far as their um, headphones and their USB cords. Don't waste your time. Just go buy you 
a charger because they are like one amp and they don't do anything for your phone. Now, if emergency cases you want to buy one and throw one in your car, then do so. But I wouldn't suggest it. But anyway, they do have like some cool stuff that helps with your phones and your tablets and stuff like that. One would be the Eco Styler pen. I really like that pen. Um, I bought a couple of those when school first started for Aaliyah's tablets. If your kids have the tablets from school, they work excellent with the tablets, okay? And they're a dollar. Um, but the I bought this because when I'm in a tub, sometimes my phone is dead and I can't like hold it because I take a lot of baths. I can't like hold it and stuff. So this way I could put it on the stand and as you can see, you can also charge it while it's on the stand. Got a box of sets on. Let me know if you guys want me to do like the food that I get from Dollar Tree because I do get food from Dollar Tree. Certain stuff, I do get it. But this is an eight pack of Sazon. This is my favorite Sazon. This has the um, coriander and anato in it. So I like this one. All right, and then this. This is the cutest, y'all. So it says internet pass. First of all, let's check out the top of this. Like, that is so bomb. The buffalo check with the um, flowers, the roses. That's really pretty. And the bottom, I can't really see the bottom. But I'm assuming that it's like the same decor. But this says um, internet passwords. And it says website name, URL, username, password. If you are anything like me, we are always opening subscriptions and emails and passwords to stuff. And I forget. Um, this is awesome because first it has the, the binder hole. So you can put it. I, I can put it in my binder. So I'm happy about that. And it comes off. It's not like that sticky paper. So it's like you could take one sheet out, put it in your binder, you know, and use it. And you just have your logins to everything on it. I thought this was genius. Um, this is not. Oh, it, it is. It's a Dollar Tree. Um, product but it is for the designs it's from three birds design and they have an Instagram Facebook and Twitter as you can see on the bottom and then next I got these fancy stickers you guys so I haven't I've been wanting to like really go sticker crazy for my planner binder thingy but um, I know that I have like a, a hell of a lot of stickers in here so I didn't want to buy any stickers I really want to buy like these crazy holographic stickers they have but I you know contain myself but they do have crafted square um, in their craft section, they have so many different stickers. They have rub-on stickers. They have auto auto coolant stickers. They have these type of stickers, which are puffer stickers. And this one is basically the little air animals. I can't think of what these are called. Comment down below. I'm like having a real bad brain fart. But I like the colors and the way it looks. These are the puffy stickers. So I think this is the last makeup item I got. If you guys don't know, Dollar Tree does carry some e.l.f. products. They don't have a lot, but when they do have them... Um, I would say go grab them because sometimes they'll put like a new item out that is not, you know, you don't normally see at Dollar Tree. I got this color correction stick and it says correct red. So I'm assuming it, co it uh, co conceals your like red spots on your face. Um, yeah, and it's by the brand Elf. Alright, and then next you guys know that Dollar Tree carries these jumbo stickers um, for your wall. You just pull them off and put them on your wall. I get these all the time. Now, are they the best? No. You might find some on Walmart or Etsy that's worth the $3 or worth the $4, but I get them just because they're a dollar. Now, they do stick good to windows because when we were trying to transfer, transfer them off the windows on Christmas, like, we had to use heating tools to get the, the stickers off. So, when you put them on your windows, be mindful that they do stick to windows. Like, really really stick to windows but when they when you put them on your walls they don't really stick that well my youtube studio but this one has like the little cameras on it and it's so cute this one i like this because it like looks like the instagram camera but just the little cameras i'm gonna put this in my background because i told you guys like i won't be filming in my room anymore hopefully i will be filming in our studio that will soon to be running up and running very soon so i will be putting them on my wall like so super hype okay about some stuff that i found all right so i looked on dollar tree's website and i have been searching for these so i finally found them these are the stainless steel mixing bowls and you can use these i like this kind of stuff in my kitchen i don't know why like you could put stuff in them to like show off for decor purposes i like these for like my eggs i don't know why i like mixing my eggs up like it just makes me feel like i'm a boss like i got a boss kitchen like even though i don't like my house is ass but <laughs> i got two of these y'all and they're just like regular little bowls, but I've been looking for these for a minute. These and the egg holders that they show on their website, I haven't seen them anywhere. And then next, I grabbed two of these bobby pins. Y'all, these are so cute. So these have like the little jewels on them, like a emerald and stuff. My daughter really loves these. My oldest daughter Tanaya, and I got her these ones as well. It has like a pearl, pink pearl. 
I grabbed these. I've been hearing a lot about these, so I figure I'd try them. This is from the brand John Frieda, and these are the um, hair masks, and this is for damage and repairing. Um, this has vitamin E oil. Now, you guys may not know this about me, but olive anything in olive oil, I cannot use. It, it dries my hair out really, really bad and makes my hair break off. So I have to be careful of that when I read the doc, you know, what's in it. But it says, um, with this powerful damage repairing hair mask infused with vitamin E oil, begin to transfer damaged hair. So that's what it looks like. I'm guessing this is like one treatment. I picked up this spoon rest, you guys. So I had two red ones for Christmas. I'm ready to pack those away. And I noticed when I had two, I don't know why I bought two. I don't even think they came together, but it was just, you don't need two of those things. You just need one. So they had this silver one. So I grabbed this one to go on my my um, stove top. And these really come in hand when you're cooking and you don't want to make a mess. You know, you take the spoon out and you sit it on here so you don't have to put it on your countertops or your stove. I got one more magazine for recipes. And this one is called, it's from the same brand, Relish. This one caught my eye because it says 19 meals in under 30 minutes. If you have a big family like mine, you know how important it is to be able to cook something really fast. So yeah, this one has like little recipes and stuff. That you can make for big families under 30 minutes. And that looks good, y'all. Mm. So I grabbed that. Look at this. It has stuffed bell peppers. It has California sliders. Beef and cheese roll-ups. And taco stuffed pasta shells. So yeah, we will be making some stuff out of these recipe books. I promise. Okay. I'm a big fan of Dollar Tree's bubble bath. So I grabbed two of these, actually. The vanilla scented bubble bath. If you guys don't know, this is a 32 ounce. Um, for me, this is about three baths. Um, if you are a bath taker like me, you would need multiple of these because I take a bath almost every night. But if you don't take baths that much, these are awesome. You can get three baths out of it for a dollar and it, it really makes a lot of bubbles, okay? So yeah, I got two of those. And then I was curious about this. I really want to try it. So I've been like wanting to like do different stuff to my coffee lately. I'm just sick of the same stuff. And this caught my eye it is for desserts teas espressos coffee soft drinks and smoothies and it's basically the vanilla syrup they put into the drinks at wawa or starbucks it is the dollar tree brand so i'm kind of skeptical but i'm still gonna try it this thing of epsom salt and it is in the scent lavender i'm not really a fan of lavender but this is the only one that they had left i don't use epsom salt every time i take a bath when i'm really hurting i'll use it does it work not really sure i feel like it's a mind thing sometimes <laughs> Especially not with Dollar Tree's um, Epsom salt. But I heard of people putting their own essential oils in these. So when I come across some good essential oils, I'll probably try that. But this says soothes minor aches, sprains, and sore muscles, you guys. And then this is a 16-ounce bag for a dollar. That I did not get from Dollar Tree, but I wanted to show you guys. So um, ShopRite has a dollar section that I knew nothing about. My mom actually put me on. But I found these little wallets, you guys. So I got me and my daughters. Well, I got all my girls one. Aaliyah, Naya, and Michaela. So I got Naya this black one because she's a little bit older. And you just pull it down. It opens up. And she can put, like, her money and her cards in it, y'all. That's so cute. That is so cute. Michaela, this one. Because I felt like she would really like it. It has this little cat on it. <laughs> See, I added it to you. And same thing. Same concept. You open it up and it has the little dividers and then i got Aaliyah this air balloon one it was only one that had like real colors in it and same thing same concept so i got those for a dollar and then i got these as well from that shop right dollar section this has nothing to do with dollar tree but i wanted to show y'all they had these dollar uh wait what are these called it's like compressed mirrors compact mirrors i said compress so yeah little mirrors with the little do rag design and i got three different ones this pink this really colorful one i got this one for um naya this really colorful one i got this one for michaela because she doesn't like purple and it's the, it's the all of them had purple in it except for the pink one so i couldn't really get around it but that is going to be a part of their valentine's day gift bag this y'all this so as i was saying that i wanted the farmhouse theme in my kitchen not so much all through the house just the kitchen so dollar tree just released like, I don't even know what these are, y'all, but I'm excited about them, and I make sure I grab everyone. If I'm missing any part of this series, or you need to comment down below, because I need it, okay? So, they just dropped these. So, I'm going to show you the first one. So, it's these little decor signs. This one has a little red truck with the Farmer's Market logo sign in it with the cow, 
and I plan on putting these all over my kitchen like in, you know in not all over but like in a decor type of way like so I got that one I grabbed this one which I'm really loving the colors of this one that that red and that yellow is getting me but this says fresh eggs and it has the rooster in it with the rooster at the top so got those two I grabbed this one that says farm fresh with the truck at the top y'all I'm so excited about these I don't know why I got that one I got this which oh my god y'all look at this this is huge for one can we just admire how big this is how chunky that is but this one has the rooster on it it does need to be cleaned up a little bit like you know painted in certain spots because it's chipped but I found these like thrown in the back of a shelf like what the hell but anyway so I got that one which will probably be my centerpiece for the other one um and I got this one that says farm to table and it has the barn in it you guys so all of those I got I got all of them I think I got all of them I, it was another one that was like green it didn't match the theme um I didn't really like that one but I also grabbed one of these wood hanging decors I'm going to be using this as a bathroom tray for my bathroom I'm gonna doll it up it's not gonna look like this but um the, these ones are the bigger ones I, I got the smaller looking like pilots like these but these are bigger ones it's the first time I've seen these two at Dollar Tree so I got those Right. and one of these products I actually used yesterday so this um is the Freeman Beauty Infusion Hydrating Cream Mask and it has Manuka and Honey Collagen and it says instantly boosts moisture restores smoothness and improves elasticity I used this yesterday right before the shower I can't really tell you like how my face felt it felt like just putting lotion on my face um, but I used it with my Bior that I already have in the bathroom. So I'm going to use it by itself to let, you know, to tell you how I feel. I don't, it says serum infused facial mask, but it doesn't set up, set up or nothing like that. It's just like a lotion. Um, it only suds up when you, I guess, wash it off, but even then it wasn't that sudsy. Um, but I'll let you guys know. Okay. So I got two of those. I used one, a half of one, and this is the third one. But I feel like in order for you to see if it works you would need like a bigger thing of it but these are cute if you wanted to put in a care package or valentine's day bag or something like that all right and i'm lying i grabbed two of those maybelline lip uh paints but this one i love red on my lips you guys this one is in the color uh red dry or not 30 so i grabbed that one too two of these valentine's day signs now I'm not decorating for Valentine's Day. We don't really celebrate Valentine's Day. Valentine's Day is not a big thing in our house. But I like the size of the signs. Now, if we're talking about Valentine's Day, I feel like the sign is really pretty. I really, really love the bike and the hearts. That's what gets me the most, the bike and the hearts. The lettering is really pretty too. Dollar Tree did a really good job with that. But you, it's hard to find. When you get the big signs from Dollar Tree, if you do crafting, when you see these, you need to grab them because... Dollar Tree, you know, they don't sell big things of wood like this. Like, so it's good to grab them for bigger pieces of crafting if you wanted to do something bigger. You know what I mean? So I got two of these. Um, this one has that truck on it. Love is all you need. Now, I might put these up on my door just to, huh, Valentine's Day. But after that's done, I plan on using these. And it's crazy because, yeah, I, do, huh, I don't celebrate Valentine's Day, but I also don't want to destroy them because they are really, really pretty. Like Next, I was so excited about this, y'all. Like, I was in the school store acting like a child. But I found these. These are new. I've never seen these in Dollar Tree. So, I got two of these kinds. So, they're like chalkboards that you hang up. And these, I got these for the girls, the older girls, because of the peace sign, y'all. Like, yes, honey, deuces. All right, so it's a like good vibes. It has, like, the stars and all of that pretty stuff on it. It has that diamond wrap with the bow, which I'm probably going to remove because that bow looks so out of place. It's like nobody wants to play with you. <laughs> Bye, girl. That's what it looks like. And then the bottom is chalkboard, so they can write little things on the bottom of them. So, yes, I got Michaela and Sanaya one for their room not really sure where i'm going to put it at yet but i plan on making their desk like come off the wall and yeah i'm about to do some freaky stuff in my house you'll see all right and then i grabbed these two for Aaliyah, and this one says stay magical and this one says belief has the unicorn and the um mermaid i feel like these go with the signs that i showed you guys earlier with the sequence and because their sister has one, I wanted to get her one. And it goes for her sign. So it was like a plus plus. Again, I'm going to remove that nasty ass little bow right there. But it's the same concept. Chalkboard on the bottom. I thought it was really cute. 
So I got both of these. This is my favorite one though, the mermaid one. Moving on. All right, so I've been searching for these, y'all. Forever. Forever. I seen these on Dollar Tree website and I was like, you're lying. Like, you're lying. So I am a fan of Dollar Tree's little baskets. Um, they look like little box drawers. I'll put a picture right here so you know what I'm talking about. I am a fan of them, okay? But they're flimsy as hell. They're Dollar Tree items. People complain about them, but what do you expect? You're paying a dollar for them. But for me, I buy them for temporary purposes only. Like when the toy starts to overflow and we got like a bunch of little pieces, I will get three of them for each baby and they last for about three months if we keep them away from the kids. They last for about three months and we throw everything in there. I also use them for socks, underwear, things of that nature. So um, these right here, I feel like I'm gonna put in my living room somewhere. Just don't know where yet, but I'm gonna open one. But Dollar Tree now has these baskets. So they got two different colors. I got two of each color white and two black i'm going to open the white one also i feel like these will look really pretty with their gold wire baskets that they have now somehow i don't know like in the same space but we're going to open it so i can show you because they have one open and i was like oh yes y'all go get these i watched some lady these and the little clear glass um not glass they're like plastic hard plastic containers that have the drawers it was, there were like, like I'm going to say like 13 of them on the shelf. She took all of them. And then when I was, she was coming around to these, I hurry up and grabbed my four. Like, girl, what are you doing? What are you building a house? Why do you need all of them? All right, but anyway, so this is what it looks like when you open it. And basically, you just push it down. Y'all, this is so freaking cute. Honestly, I wish I might. There has to be a way to turn this inside out because unless I'm opening it wrong, Hold on. Oh, I think I'm opening it wrong. Let's see, why is the print on the inside? Alright, let's get this open. You gotta be careful because it is a dollar. You don't want it to like rip or break. Alright. Almost got it, y'all. Fight me, Dollar Tree. Huh? Alright, we're getting it. We're getting it together. Alright, so this is what they look Y'all, these are cute. Like, this is what they look like. First of all, this is big. This is so cute. I would. I don't know why I see this in like a laundry area with those gold baskets. Like, I love these. These are so cute. I don't know what I'm going to do with these yet. But first of all, they're made really good. They have this wire in here, which seems pretty sturdy. I mean, you can bend it if you want it. It probably will break, but it's pretty sturdy. And I don't see how it will really break unless you were, like, really trying to break it. Because you see me just trying to open it. It wasn't like, this is a really hard, I don't know what this is, y'all. Like, it's like a, oh, God. It's like a, um, I don't know. Like, I can't explain what this is. You felt it before. It's like a mattress cover type but it has this white and black checkered on it and i feel like it goes really good with those gold wire baskets i'm gonna find a way to incorporate them together i don't know how you can even hang these in your bathroom if i could find a way to hang them like from the wall and put like uh towels and washcloths in them because i'm about to like refurbish my house y'all so yeah i got those i got four of those and if i find any more i'm grabbing them okay i just didn't want to be greedy because that lady was stalking me but i was like get get, the, get ready what are you doing? It's like, no, I didn't do it. <laughs> Again, for my kitchen, this farmer's market sign. And it says, farmer's market, Saturday and Sunday, 9 through noon, fresh, natural, local, organics. Not really a fan of the back. I really liked it this part. So I might take this part off if I can get it off without breaking it and paint the back a different color, like maybe a black or a, a white. First time I've ever seen this at Dollar Tree. So they have these wood stems now. And I've actually seen the little short stumps, the wood stumps, but I have those actually, but um never seen these. These are like the 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 thinner stems. Oh my god, I wonder it's seven ounces of stems in here, you guys. So it was three left. I grabbed one. Um I was kinda iffy. I wasn't gonna get them, but I'm like, this is the type of thing that we will never see again. You know, you'll be upset because you see this real cool DIY and it's not available to you. So I grabbed those. And I also grabbed two of these wood pen holders they're called pen holders but these are just plain wood boxes you guys hollow um 
I got two of these. I actually have a DIY in mind that I want to do for these. Um, I also grabbed the cylinder one. So, uh, I don't want to tell you guys yet, but I have a plan for mine. But I have, I have two of each. Of them. This one says home. Again, that home, you guys, they need to come out with new words on podiatry. I'm kind of tired of these ones, but... And then I'll grab the family one. So I and I've never seen these in Dollar Tree. Of course, they have um, a lot of Tupperware pieces, tight Tupperware pieces. But I've never seen them this big. And my our problem is sometimes, like, um, like Muhammad, he cooks a lot of food. And we don't have any way to store it. We usually put it in Ziploc bags, which can get messy or look messy in a refrigerator. So I grabbed two of these Short Fresh reusable um, containers with lids. And these are, it says 33.2 liters. And that's what it looks like and it has the top I'm trying to get back up on like my containers and stuff to try to stay neater in my refrigerator and my cabinets you can also use these in your pantry to like organize your beans and rice and cereal and stuff like that i didn't think about that i probably should have grabbed more i don't know why i the only reason i grabbed this is because i've been seeing it and i don't know i just keep seeing it every time i go to dollar tree i'm like let me get it but they now have the love sign which is a part of the valentine's day i think that's why i got it because i know that it's going to be gone after valentine's day but they now have the love sign and this one has this one is a thicker wood i am not going to keep it like this of course i'm going to do my own thing to it and i'm going to be removing this little string i hate these little strings i mean they're cute sometimes but not on everything grab i think three of these woodcraft cubes yes I also have a DIY plan for these. These are the whole cubes. These are also a Dollar Tree um, product, Greenbrier International. And these are 2.25 inches, 5.7 centimeters. So I got three of those DIY. I have to get my craft stuff together so I can like see what I have. Cause I haven't been crafting in a while though. I need it. And you, crafting is my love, like that's the love of my life. And this was really cute, so I grabbed it. It says Treats Funds. It's a little bank. You put like your change in it. Right now I have my change in a Pringles can, so I thought this would be, you know, perfect. It is blue. I, I've seen another one on their website. I can't remember what it says. I feel like it says like spa day, saving up for a spa day or a me day or something like that. This was new. i seen these in Dollar Tree and I was like, I'm going to try to see if Oreo likes them. I gave him one. Um, Oreo's funny. You might give him a treat and he won't eat it right away. But then later on he'll eat it. He's weird. But they're from the brand Evolve. And they're oven baked peanut butter and berry flavored latte biscuits. You guys. So I don't know. It says no corn, no wheat, no soy. No artificial colors or flavors. And no preservatives. So, um, And they're shaped like a latte. <laughs> I tried to give him one yesterday. I'm not really sure. I was so tired yesterday. I don't really know if he ate it or not. And they smell like peanut butter, y'all. But I'm going to try again. And if not, I'll drop them off at the animal shelter or something. Think of gel. I use the Dollar Tree gel. This is the same brand as, that is at the hair store for $1.49. Well, I pay $1.49. You can get it from Dollar Tree. So, yeah, this is the 8-ounce jar of gel. So, oh, I didn't tell you guys. So, from the last haul, you know, you guys know that the Vagisil bath bomb. So, I told you guys, I seen those in Walmart a long time ago. And what caught my attention was the smell. You can smell them things from, like, the aisle over. They smell so fucking good. Okay, I'm not lying. But when I seen them, I'm like, they were like $3.49. I'm not lying. Like, th maybe $4? I want to say they were close to $5 for one. And I'm like, oh, hell no. I didn't notice until I got to the register because they, they didn't have no price on them. And I was like, oh, hell no, put them back. But I wanted them so bad. So when when I seen that um, a, a YouTuber of mine, her name is Crafty Girl. She does Dollar Tree hauls. I love her. But she had them. And I was like, Dollar Tree has these things? Like, I wonder why. Why? Because, you know, I don't know. I don't know what the thing is with Dollar Tree. Like, why do, why do they have stuff like this? Like, is it deficient? Whatever the case may be. But I got two on my last haul. I used them. I love them, okay? Like, not only does it make everything it just smells so good it's not it wasn't harsh for me and i'm very sensitive my body is very sensitive i have to be very careful what i use down there amongst other things and it didn't bother me at all so i grabbed two more there are other scents i've seen them at dollar tree it's like a pink one but they don't care dollar tree i haven't seen the pink ones at dollar tree yet but i got two more and if you guys don't know these are the white jasmine vagisil um sensitive uh god bath bombs y'all so i got two more y'all and even like they smell so freaking good like i'm starting to notice that people are onto them because they're not like 
you don't see a bunch of them anymore okay and these i've been looking for forever okay from they're from the brand jot you get three in a pack i only found one but they are the self laminating sheets you guys you can actually laminate yourself and i have a little diy not much so a diy is more of a hack for the kids that i want to start to help me out with the menu in the house because that's our problem is wasting food with the, the younger kids so i'm going to be using these to laminate my own things so that the kids will have access to their menu every day but i was just so happy that i found one um i know i could probably find bigger ones and bigger packs at walmart but i don't need a big pack of them now if you need a big pack of them i suggest you go to walmart but i don't need like a big big pack of them i probably only need one more pack to be honest with you at least but this is only i want to say a four by six it doesn't say the size on here but it's very easy as you can see on the back the directions are there and yeah they're used for id cards or if you want to laminate pictures or photos or anything also grab this revitalizing natural ex extract paraben and sulfate free espresso and vitamin e dark circle and fatigue defense under eye strips you guys i've been wanting to try under eye strips for a minute um i don't have really dark under eye but i feel like i should get up on it before it gets dark you know what i mean so this is supposed to be for wake up revitalizers and you keep it on for 30 for 20 minutes now there's a, a there is a product that i have in my bathroom that i will show you at the end of the haul that i got that was supposed to be for your eyes same thing revitalization but it's not an under eye treatment it's for the whole eye and i tried it last night and literally burned my goddamn eyes out okay i don't know what's in that stuff it says alcohol free but i don't believe you dollar tree like it can't be alcohol free because my eyelashes caught the hell on fire okay so i'm going to show you that guys that I'm going to tell you that I wouldn't use it, but you guys can use it. Or maybe I'm using it wrong, <laughs> but I wouldn't use it again. But this one is under the eye, so I'm tempted, okay? But I think it's one in here, like one treatment. Oh, no, 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 no. You get 12 treatments. You get 12 treatments in here. I just don't know how you would, like, keep them moist because the, of the package. Because it does. Oh, it does. It has the zip, the locker thing in it, y'all. Oh, the hair is just, like... Saying, ask me today. It's puffy, y'all. I'm sorry. I'm getting it done soon. Alright, so I want to hurry up because I'm getting kind of chilly going next to the window. Alright, so where did I leave you? Alright, next, I got another pack of these Epsom salt. Mind you, these were two separate days, so I probably grabbed these, not remembering that I got the other ones. But these are from Spa Naturals and these are, this is the regular one. It says activated charcoal. So I never tried this one before, but I am. Um, it says pour one to two cups into warm bath water. Um, essence salt does like relax me, but it's supposed to help with like muscle pains and stuff. I never paid attention to it. Maybe I should, but I was excited about this. I'm excited to show the boys. This is something I'm going to be putting in their Valentine's Day surprise bag. Now they only had one, so hopefully I'll go out and find another one very soon. But they have this. They had this pack of Transformers washable chalk, you guys. And it comes with everybody, okay? It comes with Megatron, Optimus Prime, Bumblebee, Starscream, and Wembley. I never heard of these two. But it comes with five washable sidewalk chalks. And I love stuff like this. This is stuff that I can give them. We can go outside. They stay still. And they stay still for hours, okay? And I couldn't believe it. I really couldn't believe it. Like, I'm going to Google this and see if I can find the price of this. Because I couldn't believe that this was in Dollar Tree. It's a Hasbro product. Do you see that? I probably will never see it again. Like, which is, like, horrible because I need two. Can't find the other one, though. Alright, so I got two of these, um... Candle holders, y'all. And then look at this with the black little stem. Let me take this off. Oh my gosh. I don't know. I don't know. It's hard to come off. But I'm getting like, I want to say my living room. Because I don't know. It's really, this is really nice. Like, it has like the um, frame of it. It's like this black metal. That's cute. I got two. They had two different colors, though. They had gold and black, and I grabbed two black ones. This will be going in my kitchen. And I'm going to be... I, I know you've seen my coffee, little coffee station with the sugar and stuff like that. I want to refurbish them and put those... I don't know yet. I don't know if I want to put those in my bathroom and put these in my kitchen or vice versa. Um, I'll let you guys know, but I thought these were cute, the tops alone. So I got these. They're called um vocal hand wash only i don't know why they're called that but they're jars basically and i got three of them 
and black is the only color that i've seen you guys and they are freaking cute the hollowed out top and i was surprised to see these at dollar tree but these are really cute for a bathroom you can easily decorate this top by putting like some ribbon any ribbon you want on it you can get um if you have a cricket you can print out some words like um toothpicks q-tips i said toothpicks q-tips cotton balls stuff like that and put it on here you can get words off of etsy which i heard is really really cheap so yeah i got three of those and uh, they're stackable y'all look at that so if you wanted to use them in your pantry too like for your beans and rice and stuff like that it's like hella jewelry and i'm tired of like buying them little funky ass pouches that they have you know the little cheap pouches so i wanted like an actual little trinket box and this was cute you guys it's i'm gonna open it for y'all see that little glass trinket box and this would be cute for a gift if you wanted to give somebody a gift they wouldn't even know it was from the dollar tree this is really cute oh my god what y'all let me find out this top oh there it go bam top comes off got that pentagon shape which is really nicely done that looks very very clean and then it has this gold on here there is like some little gold scratches on there but i can fix that and then it has that cute bumblebee that bumblebee is massive as hell like would you that if that was coming if that was sitting on your jewelry box like this whole shit would be broke i break this whole damn thing that's not even a bumblebee what the hell is that that's a moth that's some damn lantern flies that been in philly all right, so, ooh, it sounds like it's breaking when you close it, though. I don't like that. Oh, I don't like that noise. Am I putting it on right? All right, I don't think you're supposed to, like, close it hard. I have two of these glass jars, and I don't know. Like, I feel like this is what inspired, inspired me to start trying different coffees out because your coffee in here, I just need some reusable straws, and the ones at Dollar Tree are too kid like I want, like, some adult straws, but these are cute, y'all. These just little, I want to say mason jars. I don't know what they call it, but to put your coffee in. And even if you wanted to decorate the top, it'd be cute as well. These are also cute for beer. Well, not cute for beer, but you get what I'm trying to say. Like, excited about this because I very seldomly catch the whole set at Dollar Tree. It's always like random pieces and colors, but I finally got a whole set for my bathroom i told you and i'm doing the farmhouse theme in my bathroom as well i think I, I didn't tell you guys that but i found a whole set and usually i get the ones with the color but i'm like no i like the white and i can actually put my own stuff in here you know what i'm saying i'm trying to save up for a cricket that's what i really want so i can start to do my own designs but i like the white the white is really pretty this will not be on my sink you guys know i don't have a freaking tabletop sink whatever you call it like but this will be on my bathroom little area the little stand in my bathroom that i'm going to be using on top of here i'm going to make my own little stand hopefully everything fits on here if not i'm going to have to buy a couple more of these to make it bigger it's like christmas i don't remember what i got okay and then i got two of these for my door test and i'm going to probably be putting this in their valentine's day surprise bag I got two of these little jewelry trinket boxes. I probably now think about it. Aaliyah probably see she, I wanna wait till she gets her own room to get stuff like this. But these are pretty y'all. These remind me of my grandma. I don't know why. My grandma who passed away. It's like she had stuff like this on her dresser and I was like, I gotta get that. But that gold around the that rim is like super pretty. This is the only color that I seen. If you are a Dollar Tree shopper, comment down below if you've seen different colors. It has that closure with the heart right there. As you can see, it closes really nicely talked about these and i don't even know what these are called i'm about to find out right now holiday bouquet displays okay and they're these oh my god i don't know what these are like these plants now i've seen these a long time ago and my at my grandma's house in the big vases that she would have like on her table or in the door but they smell so good they smell really really good um i can't really tell you the scent because i'm not getting it it's not coming to me but i smelled it before you probably smelled it before but they had these they had four left the last one was like a all silver one like this and it was like a little piece of it in a plastic they were trying to sell for a dollar and i was like uh no so i just grabbed these three and i have a vase in the basement that i'm going to be putting these on and i'm not sure where that vase is going to be going yet because i'm trying to stay away from the burgundy but the burgundy with the green it just looks really nice and has these like crystals on the green i don't know they smell real good and i just thought of my my base 
that I have in a recent. So I'm definitely going to be putting them in there, you guys. Probably with some other floral to fill it in. Maybe some black roses or something like that. Or white roses. That'll look real pretty. But I'm trying to stay away from the dark colors because we're going into spring very soon. You guys know that I use the Bior Charcoal um, Face Wash on my face. Um, so I seen this and I just wanted to try it. I'm glad that it comes this small, honestly, because this is just enough to like do a, a seven day trial, but this is the Vior, um, Rose Quartz and Charcoal. So I want to see if there's a difference. Um, so I want to, you know, I, I get stuff like this just to try on my skin and see if it works. Now the Vior Charcoal, the actual charcoal one is awesome, y'all. If you guys don't know if I ever said it or didn't say it, <laughs> should have said it, that I had really bad skin years back. I had like, um black heads on my cheeks and like around my nose it was like really bad and ever since i started using the bior i have not had a problem with my skin and you don't have to use it every day like that's the only thing that's awesome like even if you forget a couple days your skin doesn't like you don't start breaking out all crazy and stuff like that unless my period is coming on my skin is like awesome tmi but it is what it is so yeah i got this and it's just like a little one ounce thing of uh cleanser so yeah that is all for this haul today if you guys like this haul make sure you give it a fat thumbs up if you are new to the channel hey girl hey this is your girl kimmy from ali gang nice to meet you yes ma'am press that subscribe button also make sure you guys comment down below if you want to see more videos like this comment down below if you want me to do a food version as to what i buy um as far as food products from dollar tree um comment down below if you want to see a review video as to the stuff that i showed you guys like what do you want to see me use and what, what i think about the product or do's and don'ts of dollar tree i can do a video like that as well you guys know that i am obsessed with dollar tree okay i love dollar tree that is my favorite store okay it's dollar tree walmart then big lots i think all three of them are on the same pedestal you know what i mean so yeah all right you guys so thank you guys so much for watching we love you guys from the bottom of our heart and you already know what it is it's ali gang and i'm out peace